Hey, so today I want to show a quick demo on how you can give yourself a fake extra camera angle using the DVE built into the A10 Mini. So I'm talking to you now on my main face camera that is configured in the A10 Mini as input number one. I'm going into the switcher and I'm going to show you my overhead here. And um, I'm going to just turn on picture in picture. And um, nothing has changed yet. But over here in the upstream key section, I'm going to the DVE tab. I've got my fill source set to face for picture in picture. And I'm linking the X and Y size together. And then I'm going to set my size to 1.4 or 140%. And you can see that it just zoomed in. Um, so it, you normally think of the picture in picture as being smaller than the picture that it's inset to, but you can actually go over 100% and you can make the picture in picture bigger than the picture it's covering. And you can have both the source picture and the fill picture be the same. So using that, we're going to go down to the key keyframe section. I've got the rate set to five seconds. And I'm going to set keyframe A now where we're zoomed in. Now, when I hit run to full, it's going to slowly, over five seconds, transition back to that original setting, uh, which is just uh, 100%. And when I want to zoom in, I run to the keyframe that we set at A, and it zooms back in. Now, in order to easily um, use this during a show, I'm going to record a macro. And so I've opened up the macros menu and I uh, just clean this old one out here. So for zooming in, I'm going to make a macro called DVE zoom in. And whoops, I shouldn't have started recording there. To zoom in, um, let's delete that one and start over. Uh, I'm going to set this to the full, and so I want to start from zoomed out. Now I'm going to make a macro for DBE zoom in. I want to turn my key on, and I want to set the transition to on air. And then I want to run to A. We can see that taking an effect now. Good. So I'm going to stop recording. That's my zoom in. And TV normal. And I'm going to run to full. And that's it. So now I've got my two macros uh, for doing zoom in and zoom out. Now I have set my um, Stream Deck Mini to have DB, the first macro and the second macro set um, on these two buttons here. So I can easily trigger this during a show. And it zooms right in. And that's just, those are just going by the first and second macros um, in the list. So you have to make sure you have the order correct, uh, but the Stream Deck companion plugin is what um, lets me trigger those macros from the Stream Deck. That's it.